Hey, let's try this. Let's do it. So five seconds, right? Five seconds. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Perfect. Oh, and I dropped it. Oh. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> mm. You like it? So good. What's your favorite food? Probably sushi. Mm. Or ice cream. I like that. How about yours? I love Chinese food. I love hot pot. Yeah, this honestly might be like might be making its way up the list. This is so good. Yeah, especially like during winter time, you know, hot pot is like yeah. a nice thing. To... Nice, and, nice and cozy. Yeah. I love it. So how long have you been pescatarian? Also, before you say that, like explain to the Chinese fans, what is pescatarian? Pescatarian just means you don't eat meat, but you still eat fish. Honestly, I just started learning more about how the meat industry affects the environment and how much um, carbon emissions you can cut from your own personal life um, just by not eating red meat. But I eventually want to go full vegan. I'm like easing into it. Your song, Mad at Disney, mm -hmm. is a huge hit. Thanks. And it blew up on TikTok, right? Mm -hmm. How did that happen? Honestly, I still have no idea. It's a mystery to me. It was the coolest thing ever. It was the start of quarantine. And I remember being super stressed out because I just felt like I was not going to be able to get anything done. And I felt so, you know, kind of trapped. And I was like, oh, I don't know what I'm going to do. Yeah. And I remember downloading TikTok. And I don't know why, but I was against it for some reason. Like, I really didn't want to. I think just because I was unfamiliar with it. And I posted a few videos, and they didn't really do very well. And then I signed with a label called Homemade Projects. They said, I think that Matt at Disney could do really well on TikTok. Um, we would love to work with you and hear the rest of your music. So they helped promote it on the app. And then I posted a video of me singing it in my room. And it got, I think, 26 million views. Which is, it sounds insane still. Like, I still don't believe it. I remember I had a lot of anxiety the first week because I wanted to respond to all of the comments. Mm -hmm. But there were so many that I couldn't possibly respond to everyone. But I really wanted to just keep saying thank you to people. So I would sit on my phone for like six hours just responding to comments with like heart emojis. That's very nice of you. <laughs> you actually like respond to fans' comments. Oh yeah, I mean it's nice people to comment, so. Oh, that was spicy. <laughs> We're gonna pick a piece of paper and there's gonna be a topic on the paper and then we have to write a song. Cool. Are we gonna co write this song? I, well, I guess so. Let's do it. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> Potato chips. Potato chips.